Hey YouTube, just wanted to give you guys an update on my, well, I guess just show you my new snake. I don't think I've ever had him on video before. He is a Colombian red tail boa. I adopted him. Got everything that you see in this frame right here for free. Lights included, everything. Plus a little bit more bedding over there that I haven't used yet. But he's probably going on six, seven feet now. Won't get him out, he's still a little bit of food aggressive because they were feeding him in this cage and they're feeding him live, so. But this is a custom made cage that they made him. His former owners couldn't afford to take care of him. He was, they thought he was eating too much and they couldn't afford him. So they gave him to me. I've kept him before, it's part of my mom's job. She works at school and they used him for her stuff. And uh, I guess I'll just show you a little bit around his cage now. This is his like regular light, just white light bulb. Just like you'd use in your house. It's pretty bright. You know, it lights up this whole wall without it, it's just kind of dark. So, it lights up the whole wall. Yeah, those two light bulbs bro burned out on me the day I got them. And then this one is a 65 watt heat bulb. Just white, hot heat. Probably not hot enough for them. Looking into getting some new. I think these locks are pretty cool though. You could go like this, pull it out. This one doesn't like come out. There you go. You pull it out and it lifts up. And do the same thing over here. This one's a little easier. I can do this one completely with one hand. You just lift the top up and voila. Top folds up just like that. Pops back down. This is him. He's a nice little red tail bow. Okay. You're okay. Yeah, he's a little bit aggressive. But, uh, he's got a little hide. Don't want to get too close. It's just an old crate. He's got a stick. Goes all the way across. A water bowl. Some rocks down the bottom from shedding. Aspen bedding. Um. Wood background. Cork. Wood cork background that was painted just to look. Just for decoration. He's probably a little pissy because he's kind of cold. Yeah, he's not doing so well. He's a little cold. He's actually in quarantine. I'll build him a bigger cage. He needs a bigger cage. He's kind of outgrowing this cage. But I'll tell you a, bit, a little bit on just general husbandry for these guys. All you really need to keep these guys healthy is a heat source, some sort of water bowl. Maybe it's a dog bowl, a cooking pan like that is, or... Who knows what, anything really. Some sort of bedding and a container to keep them in. That's really all you need for these guys. This guy's a little spoiled. I mean, he has a hide, a branch, some rocks, cool looking background. I mean, he's really doing pretty well. I'm actually going to put these heat lamps back on him because I'm hoping I'll be able to get some new ones here pretty soon when I go to PetSmart. PetSmart Petco or something. Get a few new things for him to heat up on. Maybe a red one, something. But his water bowl's pretty much full. It's got some bedding in it, but that comes with keeping a snake. This this regular glass. Uh, it's got wheel, this cage has wheels on it. But and by the the fanciness of these legs here, if you guys can see them. Sorry, I had to sit down for the shot. Uh, if you can see them, they're kind of curved and look kind of fancy. I'm, I'm assuming because it was they took it out of their bathroom. They This was a cabinet out of their bathroom that they took out just for this guy. I'm pretty sure he's a male, not positive, but that's just a brief overview of his cage and everything. So please remember to comment, rate, and subscribe. Most important of those is comment. Constructive criticism is always uh, helpful. I actually look forward to seeing what you guys think. So, thanks. Bye.